And Mike, Orange is still flooded, and the work to clean it up is ongoing. Linda and Eddie Hollis bought this house back in 1985. They have lived here for 32 years. It never flooded before, but it obviously did this time around. And they are in their 70s, so they had to hire a crew of these guys to come in and rip the sheetrock out of this house, uh, pull out all the wet carpet and all of their damaged belongings. It's being piled up out front like so many of their neighbors are having to do. Excuse us, guys. Uh, you can see their furniture is trashed. Uh, so it's basically the, the rest of the house. And this couple doesn't know if they're going to be able to, to live here any longer. Uh, they ripped the carpet out of this room, this pool table and jukebox, and the rest of their stuff is, is likely lost forever. Um, they have been able to salvage some of their belongings. They put it in this truck here. And Linda has family members who are helping her to go through stuff. Uh, she and her husband couldn't get out on Tuesday when their house flooded. They spent the night in this Toyota pickup truck, and, and Linda joins us now live. Linda, how difficult has this been for you? I don't like to complain. It's been bad, but I know there's millions of people that's in this shape. So you got to do what you got to do. And you told me you like to collect things. You like to save stuff, and, and so much of it was ruined by this yes, storm. Yes, everything my grandkids clothes that they wore home from the hospital and my kids toys from when they were babies and that everybody's played with there's just so many things and they're just they kind of get mad at me for trying to keep it <laughs> have you have you been able to, to salvage some of those memories a few yeah not yeah. a lot but some and, and you told me that that the greatest uh, thing that that came out of this I mean you, you have your life you have I your husband have my life I do and I'm, I'm I'm very appreciative you know and I'm appreciative for everything everybody's done for us the shelter was wonderful Alexandra I don't know what was it the mega center the people there were wonderful they helped you do anything they had doctors there that were helping me <laughs> yeah well Linda listen we, we appreciate your hospitality yeah. and we wish you all the best and and and, and yeah. I know you have you're getting a lot of help and we hope we you continue are, to get that I appreciate y'all thank yeah. you very much um, Linda's gonna spend the night uh, who knows how many nights uh, with her family again still trying to salvage what they can from this house Mike Rick Leventhal with a family's personal heartbreak in Orange Texas Rick thank